The holiday bake sales aren't exactly an original idea, but the one at Dixon High School that they are cooking up is a lesson that exemplifies the true spirit of the season. <laughs> We baked these cookies, we sold these cookies, we've raised money, and it's contributed directly to Ivan's care and independence. When students learned 16 year old Ivan Contreras was paralyzed after a backyard accident, they decided to put their home economic skills to work. New tonight, CBS 13's Adrian Moore, live in the newsroom with details. Adrian? Sam and Christina, Ivan now uses a wheelchair, and after his fellow students raised some $600 at a bake sale earlier this year to help out with some medical bills, they adopted this kind of go big or go home mentality, and they're at it again this holiday season. Right now, making some brownies. Most teenagers spend their free time at the mall or hanging with their friends. But many of these Dixon High School students are baking for a teenager they don't even know. I don't know who he is, and that doesn't matter to me. I want to help him. Lexi Irby is the creative culinarian behind the fundraising effort to get 16 year old Ivan Contreras the money his family needs for a van that can accommodate his motorized wheelchair. So I was jumping in my backyard and trampoline. So I was doing a flip, and then I, next thing I know, I was on the laying on my back and I couldn't feel from my chest down. Ivan, just 16, suffered what doctors call an incomplete C4 spinal cord injury and is now paralyzed. News of his injury spread quickly around campus, as did the medical bills and heavy lifting. For me, it's really hard. I, I usually have to have uh, two persons to help me to put him in the car. There are just some incredible teenagers who want to make the world a better place and what better way to make your own world a better place than by starting with your own community. And with an army of 50 student chefs baking positivity into each bite, Ivan's mission is to channel their hard work into his recovery and learning how to walk again. I had in my head that I'm going to walk again. I'm just going to be normal. I'm going to be me again. Such a positive attitude, and Ivan is planning on going to college and says someday he wants to become an orthopedic surgeon. Now, if that piece actually made you hungry and you're in the market for some brownies or cookies, guys, all you have to do is go to their bake sale tomorrow. It is at the Dixon Annual Christmas Tree Lighting Festival. It runs from 4 to 8 p.m. If you want more information, just go to our website, cbs13.com. <laughs> all right, Adrian, thank you very much for that.